today we're gonna be showing you guys some really cool and easy summer hacks to make your summer better. It's been a while since we've done a life hack video, and if you guys are excited for this life hack video, then go ahead and give this video a like. Let's try to get this video to 100,000 likes. So one of the main things about summer is that it does get really, really hot, and sometimes maybe your air conditioning isn't working, or maybe you're going outside and it's really, really hot. And with this life hack that we're about to show you guys, it will be a really effective way to stay cool throughout the heat. So for this hack, all you're gonna need is a t-shirt, and what you wanna do with the t-shirt is you want to go ahead and soak it in some water. Here we go. Soak it, really, really soak it. After you soak the shirt in the water, you're going to want to put the shirt inside the freezer and just let it soak for a little bit. So we're going to check up on our shirt now. It's been about one hour and yeah, let's take a look. Oh my gosh, wait. It's like frozen. There's like ice on it. What? Wait. Oh my gosh, wait. This is cool. <laughs> Whoa. There we go. Look at that. <laughs> shirt. Okay, so some of you guys probably already have a very good idea on what we're gonna do with the shirt. And obviously, if you're very, very hot, this is a good way to cool down. So let's try it on, Alan. Why do I have to be the one to do this? I don't want to take off my shirt. Oh, I don't even. Oh my way, it's not coming off. Oh. <gasps> Listen to it. Look how cool this sounds. Oh, this is freezing. Wait, I, why do I have to put this on? I don't want to put it on, Alan. Oh, okay, well, rock, paper, scissors. Rock. No, I'd rather do, <laughs> what are the odds? What are the odds? Uh, one in, one in 10. One, one two, two, three, four. That means you have to put it on. No, that means you have to. No, I don't want to put this on. No, wait, you know what? It's kind of hot outside, so why not put it on? But so say you just got done working out, you're going on a run, and it's really hot. This right here is gonna be the best way for you to cool down. Oh my gosh, Woo! it's burning hot. All Give right. me a shirt, Alan. Give me something to wear. I need to cool down. Woo! Okay, here we go. It's going on. Oh my gosh, you guys have no idea how good that feels after a workout, guys. If it's super hot and your air conditioning isn't working, this is definitely something I would wear. Now that we have this, Wait, we don't like we even should... need air conditioning anymore at this yeah, point. What's the point of air conditioning? I'd say we just put all of our shirts in a freezer and just like that we have unlimited supplies though. Maybe save a little bit on electricity. Cause this is, this feels extra good. So overall guys, I would definitely recommend this. It's a very easy and cool hack to try out. And yeah, let's move on to the next hack. Have you ever been at the beach and have all your valuable items with you and you were too scared to go into water because you thought someone would steal those things from you? Well, today, we're gonna be showing you guys a really cool hack that's gonna make you worry no more. All you need is a baby wipe and you're gonna want to take out all the baby wipes inside of the baby wipes bag. And after that, you can now put all of your valuable items inside like this. So now I can put my phone in here. There we go, go. And you can put your keys in there afterwards and your credit card or some cash. Wow, we could even fit a lot more in here. Honestly, you can just leave this behind because who's gonna wanna look through baby wipes? Like no one's gonna look at baby wipes and be like, oh, I'm gonna need to steal that. And if you wanna feel even safer, you can get another bag of cleansing wipes and just leave it right next to it and we're good. So overall, I would say this is a very easy life hack to do, and honestly, this could also work with a sunscreen bottle as well. It just depends whatever you have on you at the time. But yeah, this is very easy and very safe. And if you're going to the beach, you should definitely try this life hack. So a big part of your summertime is putting on sunscreen. And sometimes applying sunscreen to your back can be difficult. And even when you have a friend, sometimes your friend doesn't want to get their hands dirty. And that leaves you with this option right here. All you need is a pool noodle, some sunscreen, and let's just show you guys how it's done. Oh, that was quick. Oh my God. All right, so, oh, see, I can't even reach my back. Look at that. Wait, Alex, can you help me put sunscreen on my back, bro? No, man, that's your back is disgusting, Alan. I, I'm not doing that. Well, I have a pool noodle right there. You know what? This changes everything, Alan. Give me the sunscreen. I got you. So this is the proper way to put on sunscreen, guys. So squeeze the sunscreen inside of this tube right here. The pool noodle. There we go. Now, next step. So here's the next step. Here's a few ways you can apply it. Okay, so there's two ways to do this, guys. You can either do it like this right here, blow on it. Like that, or you can just shake it out like this. Oh, 
Oh, oh, that's cold. And now he probably has the sunscreen on his back. Okay, you know what? I'll help you rub it in. I actually feel like that was the dumbest. <laughs> this is actually the dumbest summer life bag right here. Long story short, if your friends aren't willing to put sunscreen on your back, then you need some new friends. So this next life hack right here, we're actually gonna show you guys how you can make your own shower. So most of the time the public showers don't work. So all you need is a plastic bag of your choice. Fill it up with some water, poke some holes inside of it. You can either get your friend to hold onto it or if you can like hang it somewhere, either way works. And afterwards you can bring your shampoo and conditioner and you can just have your own little homemade shower. So I actually wanna see if this works or not, uh, let's do it. So for this one, all you're gonna need is a plastic bag with some water filled inside of it. And this is really good because we don't have any shower heads outside. And let's just say I needed to wash my hair. Well, let's try it out. So I'm gonna go ahead and take off my shirt. Let's not show my stomach. I'm out of shape. Since we don't have anywhere to hang it, which obviously you can do, but I just, I'm just gonna have him hold it just for the example's sake. Uh, hold it up and poke some holes underneath it with a fork or anything that you want. Oh my gosh, there we go. And look at this, guys. I am going to be taking a shower. And you're watering the plant. Yeah, and we're also watering the plant. So let's look at this win-win. You know, if I had some shampoo and conditioner, I could be really wetting my hair right now and just really getting a good wash in there because, you know, honestly, this saves water. This is um, super handy and, yeah, like, look at this, guys. We're saving water. I'm hey, look at that. That's not even half the back, so if I really wanted to, he could even wash his hair. I could wash my hair, too. Uh, so right here, we're going to show you guys another cool life hack. So this is a really good hack when you're at the beach. Um, looks like you need a Ziploc bag and you put your phone inside the Ziploc bag. And basically, it's a really good hack if you want to avoid getting sand into your phone. And it seems like it works perfectly. You can still tap the screen and whatnot. So let's but, try it out. So we have a Ziploc bag right here and we're going to see if this works or not. Okay. Oh, it fits perfectly. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at that. And okay, guys, moment of truth. We're going to see if it works or not. Unlock. It works. It works. Oh my gosh, guys, it works. You can scroll, you can get on Instagram, you can get on anything without having fear of getting sand into your phone. This is honestly- That's so cool. I honestly didn't think something this simple could be so like effective. That's like a really cool hack. Wow. We're actually going to the beach tomorrow and I'm so serious. We're actually gonna try this at the beach. Oh, and for everyone who's curious uh, who my lock screen is, this is actually my girlfriend. Um, she doesn't know that I exist, but I- I don't even know if she exists. So we got the next life hack right here and let's just go ahead and show you guys what it is. I mean, I sometimes get annoyed from holding my phone, and I've always wanted a stand. Oh, so all you need is a pair of sunglasses, and obviously, if, you're, if you get tired of holding your phone, then you have a pair of sunglasses. It's a pretty handy phone stand, so yeah, let's try it out. So we have our sunglasses right here, and this is how it's gonna work. So we're gonna flip it like this, and now let us set our phone right here. Wow. Look at that, now you can rotate it, watch videos, whichever direction you want, and this is just a super easy homemade phone stand. I feel like it's considered a summer life hack because people wear sunglasses during the summertime, so you're always gonna have a pair of sunglasses on you. That's actually so cool. Oh my gosh. Like, look at that. This is so cool. I can just eat food and just watch videos. So obviously, there's a lot of different types of floaties out there. There's the pink swan floaty, there's the pizza floaty. But right now, we're gonna show you guys the coolest floaty that you can make, and it's actually made with junk food. All you need are some really large bags of chips and some really strong tape. Okay, so we just made our own personal floaty right here. A large inflatable made from junk food. We're gonna try to see if it floats in a pool or not. Uh, let's try it out. It works. Wait, does that actually float? It actually works. No, like, I'm serious, it actually works. It, it floats? Wait, rotate around, rotate it around. Wait, rotate it around, rotate it around. As you guys can see, he actually can float. That's, uh, I never thought this was possible. This is like my dream, you know, like laying in a pool in the summertime, eating snacks, like, you have unlimited snacks to choose from, so this is, this is definitely my dream. So right here is the last hack that we're gonna show you guys. Um, so they have YouTube open up and they like the video and then subscribe to the person. Oh wait, is that us? 
the oh, stuff. Wait, that's our channel? Oh, oh, so it looks like they liked and subscribed to our channel. And looks like that was the best hack of them all. Why was this last? We saved the best hack for last. <laughs> but honestly, if you guys enjoyed the video, please let us know by subscribing and liking the video. And honestly, if you guys want to see more life hacks, let us know in the comments. And yeah, with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you guys next time. time. Thank you.